Ooh, what's on my face? Boys, in honor of National Yoga Day, which is today, we're gonna do some yoga. I think. I don't know. <laughs> you ready? Yeah, I think so. Yay! Okay. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel, Get Zen with Jen. I am Jen. Today I have Chris Pickering, AKA Pickering Fitness with me. Um, Today we have a dynamic or active warm up. It's gonna be about 10, 15 minutes um, and we're gonna go through it pretty quickly so it's less of a slow yoga flow, more of a warm up energizing flow. So when you're ready, hop on the mat and we'll get started. Okay. So we're gonna start in tabletop position. So making your way to your hands and your knees. Our hands are below our shoulders, our knees are above or below our hips, fingertips spread wide, flat, flat back. We're gonna first inhale and look, oh, okay. Okay. We're gonna first inhale, dropping our belly down, hips up to the sky, looking straight forward in cow. Inhale here, exhale, rounding the back tucking our tailbone down, finding ourselves in cat. And back inhale into our cow. And following your breath, exhale to cat. Inhale, we'll just go through a couple of these motions, warming up the spine, very central part of our body for any type of exercise. Really making sure we're keeping the shoulders away from the ears. Chest comes forward and then chest rounds. Inhale forward, exhale to cat. And on our next one, we're gonna shift our hips to the left, coming down into a cow position, bringing our chest forward so that we're just above the wrists here. So our shoulders are in front of the wrists. And then we're gonna bump our hips to the right and come back into a cat and we'll be just below or behind our knees. So we're gonna come in this sort of figure eight motion, warming up the side body, continuing to warm up the spine, just finding some organic movement here and switching directions, making sure not to forget about our breath. And meeting back in tabletop position tuck our toes under and we're going to come back up into a downward dog. So starting with our hips, coming up all the way to the sky, straightening our legs, releasing our heels towards the mat, shoulders away from ear. So if you need to, you can spread your um, hands a little bit wider than your shoulders. Inhale here, exhale, come forward into a plank position. Inhale at the top and on an exhale, we're going to lower down into a push-up. So tricep push-up. Our elbows are close to our body and exhale back up and switch back into our downward dog leading with our hips. Perfect, picking up the pace here. Inhale forward, exhale down, inhale up, exhale back to downward dog. Inhale forward, exhale down, inhale up, exhale back. Keep going, inhale forward, flat back, Exhale down, elbows stay into the side body. Exhale up and backwards. One more of these, inhale forward and down, up and back, perfect. So hanging out in downward dog for a moment, we're gonna take our right leg, lift it into the sky into a three-legged dog. Inhale here, exhale coming forward into a lunge position, a runner's lunge. So our back leg is not on the mat here. Planting our left hand down, inhale, right arm comes up to the sky into a spinal twist here. And exhale back down, find our way back to our downward dog, and we'll switch sides. So inhale, left leg up into the sky, exhale forward into our lunge, right hand plants, and twist back down. Back into our downward dog, inhale, right leg up, exhale forward, and our spinal twist back down. So here we're warming up the shoulders, the quads, left leg up and come forward. 
our spine is getting a nice twist. We open up our chest on the, when we raise our hand into the sky, back into our downward dog. Inhale, right leg up. Exhale, forward. Spinal twist, open up the chest, down. Back into our downward dog. Inhale, left leg up. Exhale, forward and twist. Perfect, coming back into our lunge. We'll stay in our lunge position here. And what we're gonna do is go into a pyramid to a lunge. So right now we're in our lunge. We're gonna pop up, so using some leverage in our back foot here, pop up into a pyramid. So our foot comes closer to us. We're in still two parallel lines with the feet into a pyramid position. Inhale, rise up. Your fingers can come off the mat. You wanna have a flat back here. Exhale down and then dropping our or bringing our leg back into a low lunge position. Perfect, so inhale, looking forward, chest forward, and up into our pyramid. Exhale down into our lunge, chest forward, and up into our pyramid. We're getting good hamstring stretch here. Exhale down into our lunge, and our right hip flexor as, our, as we're in our low lunge here. Back up one more time on this side, pyramid, and down. Perfect, plant the palms, come back into our plank. Pause here for a moment. Feel that energy, feel the heat in the body. And exhale, bring our right foot forward into our low lunge. Inhale, looking forward. Exhale, up into a pyramid. Two parallel lines with the feet. Inhale, looking forward. Fingertips coming off the mat. Exhale, down. And back into our lunge. So our knee is not coming all the way to the mat here. We're staying in our in a high, uh, or sorry, a low lunge, but a runner's lunge, an active lunge. Back up into our pyramid. Feel that really good stretch in the hamstring and back into our lunge. Perfect. One more up. And coming down to our lunge. This is the last one here. And back down here. Excellent. So coming up into our wide-legged forward fold. We'll also come into a five-pointed star. So we can lead with our left hand here, sort of take a rainbow motion above our bodies here, rising up into a five-pointed star. So our feet are pointing out to the edges of our mat. Our feet are wider than our hips. And inhale, hands up into a star-like position. On an exhale, taking our right hand to our left foot. Perfect, inhale back up. Exhale, switching sides. And back up. So our eyes are following where our hand is going. We're warming up the inner thighs before the spine. Inhale, back up. Exhale, reach all the way up to the sky. Keep that chest open. Inhale, back up. Awesome, looking great. And we'll do one more for each side. Inhale up. And exhale here. Inhale back up, five-pointed star. And now we're gonna drop into our goddess pose. So sinking into a squat here, our knees are tracing over our feet and we're standing tall. So keep our head above chest, chest above pelvis. And we're just gonna pause here for a moment, feel our quads get engaged. Awesome work. So. Hands up into a second position, ballerina position. And we'll take our we'll tilt to the right, bringing our right arm down, our left arm above our head, feeling a good side body stretch here. Perfect. Back into center and switching sides. So, a really good stretch in the obliques here. Inhale, center. Exhale, sides. Inhale, back to center. Exhale, to our side. Keeping our chest proud, looking straight forward. Our quads are working here, our core is working. Keeping our tailbone tucked down. Not forgetting about our breath, back to center. One more for each side. Perfect, and before we leave Goddess, we're gonna pause here for a moment, keep our hands up in second, high into a T-shape. We'll pulse here for a moment, just really turning on those 
sides, gaze is straight forward, chest is up, tailbone tucked down. Deeper breaths here. In five, four, three, two, one. Rise up. And in just the last couple of moments here, a left yogi type move. We're just gonna shake out our body. So jumping on the balls of our feet, side to side, getting out any extra tension in the body that we might have missed. You can take your hands up, down to the side, cross around. Three, two, and one. Fantastic. So arms or hands together at our chest. Inhale, looking forward. Awesome work, guys. That was a quick warm up and active stretch before you get into your workout. Thank you for joining me today. Thank you for my amazing partner here, Chris Thank Sigrid. you for having me. Um, so take care, enjoy your workout, and we say namaste.